Tato never disappeared, but was actually killed by Kat herself. Tennant secures the algorithm before the explosion at the hypercenter, and crucially, before Kat takes Sator's life into her own hands. The explosion at the hypercenter, and actually killed by Kat herself. Tennant secures the algorithm before the explosion at the hypercenter, and crucially, before Kat takes Sator's life into her own hands. The algorithm device is split into three pieces, and taken by the protagonist, Iris and Neil, the three intent to hide the components from future threats, and it is implied that they should kill themselves to prevent their knowledge from spreading. Hide the components from future threats, and it is implied that they should kill themselves to prevent the knowledge from spreading. At the end of the mission, Neil reveals that he was actually recruited by the protagonist in the future, and that, from his perspective, they have known each other for several years. Neil's timeline runs backwards compared to the protagonists. This explains how Neil was able to know the protagonist's preference for Diet Coke when they first met. In this same scene, you can see a red string attached to Neil's bag. This indicates that he is the soldier who takes the bullet meant for the protagonist in the hypercenter. It explains that he plans to revisit the site using time inversion to make sure that he can open the lock center. It explains that he plans to revisit the site using time inversion to make sure that he can open the lock door, as he is the team's best to revisit the site using the turn who takes the bullet meant for the protagonist in the hypercenter. It explains that he plans to revisit the site using time inversion to make sure that he can open the lock door, as he is the team's best lock picker, which thus seals his fate. Essentially, the protagonist's first mission with Neil is Neil's final mission with the protagonist. Neil also hands his plea for the protagonist the lock door, as he is the team's best lock picker, which thus seals his fate. Essentially, the protagonist's first mission with Neil is Neil's final mission with the Things for the character still continue to travel on chronologically. 
The events of the movie split not too long after this, with the protagonist and his mother traveling back in time. Max continues forward until the end of the movie, which is when he's picked up by his mother at school, and he actually gets to go.